Hey, my name is Mason Brown and this is my calling. So here I am, I'm at Indiana Wesleyan University getting first-hand ministry experience. I'm meeting new people. I'm learning how I can love them even more and more. And I'm working alongside professors, pastors, students, and I'm just soaking it all in and loving it. And it's all because Christ intervened. So I've always had this knack for talking to people and loving them and serving them. Even when I was younger, I knew I wanted to be a pastor. Christ affirmed that calling on my life in 2015 at the Follow Conference. So I was there, a speaker was speaking about gifts and callings, and at the end of his message, he said, come up to the front of the arena if you feel led to go into full-time ministry feeling led. Guys, I didn't grow up in the church. And at this point in my life, I've probably been going to church for maybe a year now. So I didn't know what being led meant. And there was no booming voice or some angel descending from the sky to tell me what being led really meant. But I just knew that I couldn't leave that arena without accepting that call to love people and serve them. And it was that night that I accepted that. So I pursued ministry after that, but not without doubt, guys. Man, did I doubt. I doubted about if God can provide for my family financially on a pastor's salary, if I can even get into a good college. I had all these different doubts and they just kept piling up. But God kept reminding me, he said, Mason, you need to wake up every morning and just love me, love yourself and love others. And that's it. And I did that. I woke up every morning. I said, God, I'm going to love you today. I'm going to love myself. and I'm going to love others. And it was through that continual act of loving that I became affirmed in my calling. And I did that day after day after day after day. And now today, it led me here to Indiana Wesleyan University. And it is all because Christ intervened. Mm-hmm.